also, it's kind of cold today. Uh, even though it warmed up a little earlier, now that the sun is starting to go down, it's getting a little chilly. But the outside of this place, so far, man, it looks good. I mean, yeah, there's a big pile of trash right there. But um, the outside of the property still got to get pressure washed. But other than that, it's looking really good. I got two broken windows now that I got to replace because there was some kids in the neighborhood that decided they were going to play soccer in the yard and they broke the windows. Um, I don't think that these guys have actually been here working on the property because I don't see any more trash out here. I was expecting to see like the boxes for the tubs, but we're going to go in and check it out and see what they got going on. And then um, I also had a lot of trouble trying to get the water turned on here because this area has a private well or a community well that you have to contact a third party provider in order to get it turned on. So let's go ahead and check this place out and see what it's looking like and uh, see if they've done anything, which I don't think they have, but oh well. well. All right, so as you guys know, the last time I was here, there was a bit of shooting going on, but uh, so far we got all the tubs in place. I'm hoping that they can get everything wrapped up by next week because I'm really hoping to get this thing rented out. Um, so far though, it looks really good, really, really good. I'm actually pretty impressed because this place was like really dark and gloomy. Um, it looks like there's a couple knobs still missing from the kitchen. But overall, the quality of this place has gone up dramatically. I did put a, a good amount of money into this on purpose. I wanted it to look good. I wanted it to be a quality place because if it looks good, it's going to rent good. Um, well, that's not all the time, but <laughs> it is the majority of the time if it looks good. You know, you're gonna get a good quality renter in there because obviously if it looks really bad, you're not gonna get good rent out of it because the person that you're gonna attract is somebody who's used to a substandard of living. Um, even though this is a trailer, like this is a nice trailer. Like, I mean, would I live here? No, because it's too small for me and my, my family, but you know, anybody just starting out, uh, you know, this is a, a great, you know, first place uh, to live because it looks good. It's clean, it's roach free, it's got no immediate neighbors. You don't have to worry about, you know, making your neighbors mad because you're too loud. Um, it's a great place. I mean, in my opinion, if this was my first place moving out to, I would totally live here. This ain't too bad. The neighborhood is quiet. Yes, I know the gunshots, but <laughs> I think it was just somebody you know, messing around with a gun in the backyard or something like that. So what do you guys think? 50 grand is what I spent on this place. Um, so far, not bad. Definitely a good investment. It's gonna make about $1,100 a month. So 50 grand to make $1,100 a month, not bad. And it's not really an appreciating asset because it's a mobile home. Mobile homes lose value, they don't gain value, but not bad. So what do you guys think? as far as prospering in 2023. Do you think what I had to offer you guys was even worth watching this video? If you did, comment down below. Let me know that you watched this whole thing all the way down to the end. And if you did watch this all the way down to the end, I appreciate you guys, you know, so, so much. You have no idea how long it's been since like I've started YouTube and all the friends and people that I've met. I, I even went to Deal Machine headquarters because they you know, have seen me promote Deal Machine all the time. Um, it's, it's such an amazing journey. You know, and even though I have like 2,000 subscribers at this moment in time, it has still been a lot of fun. I, I don't do this for the fame. This is, <laughs> this is my video diary of my life as a real estate investor. This is for my kids my kids kids and maybe even my kids 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 you know who knows this is this is something that's going to live on the internet forever so that my family can see where did we start our journey in real estate so thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate all of you being fans for however long you've been fans for 
and I'll catch you guys on another vlog.